Season has changed. Spring has come. What does that mean? <laughs> Should I have a look up at what spring means? Spring doesn't pop so much as the others, as it visually aims at a slighter, lighter yellowish blend of green. The weather conditions aren't really too different from vanilla, just the temperatures are slightly lower, with the day still not being the full length. Some snow from winter hasn't fully dried out, so you can expect more snow clearing out near the mountains. That is according to the mod page. I have also cut my hair, as I said I would. We've smartened ourselves up a little bit. I think I may have to change that sort of gun belt and the accessories that's going on it, and how it clips through my leg like that. I'm not a fan. But I shall be going back to the trapper anyway, because I have added some clothing mods. Or one clothing mod, YM's DLC, which adds 2,500 plus new items. <laughs> so hopefully I'll be able to find something to wear. And also see if this mod has been installed correctly. It's the biggest mod I've installed. It took a little while. Everything else you install, like the load bar just goes zoom. This one, no, no zoom. Very slow zoom, as you would expect, adding over 2,000 items to the game. <laughs> I'm sorry if I'm boring you with these two consecutive episodes of shopping, but I haven't done any, right? That's what happens, I leave it and then I just sort of do it all at once. But this mod, as well as like the clothes, it also adds haircuts, so it's kind of annoying that I cut my hair before adding this mod, because I may have been able to do something with that. I mean, I may still, it might not be like the main game where you can just sort of put whatever on your head without having to have the correct length. Uh, there's also stuff for the horse. I don't think I want to change Billy. I think he's perfect the way he is, so I won't be looking at that yet. Maybe sometime in the future, but there's no rush. And there's also things to customise weapons and stuff, which I probably will do at some point to change the ones I've done, so I'm not too happy, I don't think, with what I already did. But again, that's not an immediate concern. The trapper's being attacked by fucking wolves. Maybe I should like hurry up because he might die. Have they killed him? No, he's okay. Glad to see you again, sir. Do you want to make use of these pelts? They're probably in poor condition, but they might be better with my talisman if I skin them in front of you. But I don't care. They're they're not going to be perfect, are they? Right. Quality hide makes the hardiest clothes around. Don't doubt it. YM's wardrobe. Here we go. Load of new stuff in here. Look at all this shite. Got good stuff. I should say not shite. I don't know where to start. Should we just look at? Should we go down the list? So this is. I just went for like a clean cut, completely different look. Oh, he's got John's classic hat. That's cool. <laughs> where John's hat? Oh, what is this? Best trapper I ever knew. My fourth wife, native. He'd find a trail while the bloodhound was still sniffing its own ass. Hell of a woman, rest her soul. I wonder if some of these hats are hats that you can find normally in the game, but you can't um, keep them. And uh, this guy has uh, just made them all available. Was he like designed them all himself, you know? Look at this hat. <laughs> Deputy hat, that's quite a cool hat. A lot of folk want to apprentice under me. <laughs> I got no competition. Why would I want some? Okay, I'm going to end up spending a while in here. <laughs> trying to figure out what I want. <laughs> oh my god, Jack Sparrow's hat. I can't wear a pirate hat. That makes no sense. The Fenton scratched. Yeah, so the, I guess a load of these hats are hats that are just available in the game, but you can't normally buy them. Or wear them, keep them, right? Dakota, tall trees, big valley, Roanoke. I run this stall just about everywhere. Best way to source the skins. So many. Ringmaster. Oh, that's a nice hat. That hat's quite nice. Fools. Oh my god. Shaman uncovered. I don't know what to go with. Look, there's fucking Milton's hats in here. Mickey's hats, the homeless vet. Yeah, that's what has happened to it. That's pretty cool that they've done that. I've run this stall all the way from here to the border. The northern border, that is. And I've never been out of border. Oh. 
police hat. Oh my god. Isn't that the Conquistador hat? I can get that anyway, I think. My eyebrows like uh, been bleached. A lot of folk hunt, but not so many know their way around a needle and thread. It's good business, I'm telling you. Like a beanie. Can <laughs> wear a fucking beanie. <laughs> Could be a hipster. No, we we still need that sort of cowboy look. It's, I think it's the light. It's the light that's shining on me. It's sort of making my hair. I, I can't start with the hat, I don't think. I think I would like to start with something else. I don't know where I'm going to go with this sort of stuff. Maybe a coat to start with. I'd wager I can travel faster with this stall and tow than you or anyone can with nothing but a horse and a saddle. It's not about speed, it's about knowing the land. Eloquent coat's nice. Okay, but if oh my god, look at this fur coat. It's a Driscoll coat. Oh so so many options. We can go no no coats. Just bare chested. Wish I never had to take my stall into the sea. Just like I wish country folk had any damn money. <laughs> <laughs> does, it, I swear, does this come with ponchos? I thought it did. Does it does it not? I don't I really I have like facial hair, I don't know what's happened to it. Get under undercards. Does, it, does this not have punches? Oh, I can fucking wear John's fucking gunslinger vest. I do like that, but it's John's clothes. Can't wear John's clothes. Maybe this didn't come with um, ponchos. I was wrong. It's where a bloody deputy bears because everyone keeps thinking we are wearing it anyway. Right, I need to. I need to change. First things first, I need to change like the gun belt as well, don't I? He already, he, it looks like the modders made some outfits on here already. That's John's clothes, isn't it? Anti eleven cowboy. That's sort of like changing a little bit of what we currently wear, isn't it? Fence. <laughs> oh my god. Ah, so th there is ponchos here because he's made an outfit with one. Where are they then? And it looks like they fit properly. I want a poncho. Accessories? Well, these are satchels. Gold chains. Oh my god. Oh god, I could spend fucking ages in here. Where are covers? Cloaks? Aha, here they are. Okay. Alright, but I think first we just get undressed. I want a slate I want a clean slate, I think. I'm gonna fuck around quite a bit here, so you don't have to watch this. I'll, I'll probably fast forward it. I think that's okay, you know. I kind of like that. We give that a go, and then we get bored of it. We can change it. I would like to get rid of the um, the compass, though. Maybe I can do that in my wardrobe. It's very different, isn't it? It's much more sleek. I mean, the weather has changed as well, right? So I think it makes sense. Back off or soon. Yeah, it's that that compass needs to go. But otherwise, I think I'm okay with this. Okay, bye now. Right? I kind of like it. I kind of like that. My clothes go a bit more with my horse now as well, don't they? I think. My horse is still really blinked out, but I kind of like what we got at the moment. I do need to be able to save the outfit as well, it'd be nice. I really like those sorts of ponchos you wear over your shoulders. It's really nice. I like the hat as well. Much different look, right? But still sticking with the Western theme. I don't want to get all spruced up. You know, I don't want to be wearing like beanies or top hats or the little bowler hats. You know, we need to look like Clint Eastwood type or that we live in the old ways still, right? And we're sticking with the old ways. No modernization. And the... The pistol that I got, the Lowry's pistol, I may have to change that because I don't think it really suits us, does it? It's got like sort of like blood writing and stuff on it. I think it would suit more of a low honourable character. If I was to use the Navy revolver, I would just buy a standard one, I think, and customise that. I've not really been that impressed with it. I think I prefer the Schofield. Whoa, 
Ooh. what you have them for, for Pete's sake. Now put your hands there and push! Come on, come on, show me something. You better not drop it. You better not. What come the on, hell are you fools? Where? Oh, it's the KKK. They've oh, just died. Jesus! <laughs> you damn oh, you're coming fool. to me? Look what you did! Oh, Lord. Oh! You ain't much of a fighter, huh? You are not getting me. Fuck you. I thought we already killed the leader of this gang. I guess um, they made a new one. I thought there was some people, like, um, recreated a nativity or something. You know, some sort of play with Jesus Christ, with the cross. <laughs> I didn't realise who they were until I opened my mouth. <laughs> you all right, Jose? Fine. Fine, I'm fine. You ain't fine. We'll all be in far Hi, worse trouble soon enough, unless you get your head straight, Dutch. How are you feeling? Tell him, Arthur. Tell him to wake up and fast. I'm trying, God damn it. Am I going to say something? Or I thought I was about to say something. No? Is that heavy breathing there? No? Okay. Guess I just um, can't be asked. <laughs> right. Uh, this chest here is my wardrobe, isn't it? Yeah. Gun belt trinkets. No, no trinket, please. Compass is still there. Oh, it's gone. Good. Right. Compass is gone. Nice. Thank you, Mr. Morgan, for sparing me like that. I'll work hard. I am not a bad fella. You'll soon warm to me. Just see that I do. Oh, you will. And boy, hmm? thank you for saving my life. Well, yeah, of course. That will be all. Anyway, I won't disturb you. Sure, be good now. Mm-hmm. Okay, so let's play with Lenny. Lenny? Hey, Arthur. That knife's sharp enough, ain't it? Depends. Why? You feel lucky? <sighs> Do you? Oh, before me? At least six generations were born in chains. And for the last three years, I've been running from every lawman and bounty hunter west of the Lanahassee River. So yeah, I feel lucky. I'm the living embodiment of luck. That is one way of seeing things. But I'm also skilled. And in this game, you got to have luck and skill. And stupidity. The Outlaw's Trinity. Luck, skill, and just a dose of stupidity. Come on. You ain't too old and too slow just yet. After you. As you wish. You know, we should head back up that mountain sometime and make Jenny a proper grave. Some nice. You liked her, didn't you, kid? Uh, well, sure. I mean, <laughs> yeah, I liked her. I know, kid. And I'm sorry about it. Anyway. That's not a bad idea, though. Step up. Let's go. Okay, I got this. Could go up there to do that. Uh. God, it's only AB. That's the easy one. So Ow. we have attempts here. Because before when we played this, there wasn't attempts. Oh, I've got it in a bag, mate. Yeah, it is the same, isn't it, that I'm using? AB, AB? Should be. See, not a problem. Are you embarrassed? You should be. Giving it the big gun, and then um, you're so shit. A Y A Y, A. My go. Ain't gonna last. <laughs> well, mate, it's gonna get harder as it goes on, so you're just gonna get worse, aren't you? Have we won? Has it finished? I can keep going. Is it going to be the same? Have I exhausted everything here? No. This has to be hurt. Uh, this way it does get a bit harder. B, 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 X, X. Your turn. Now, let me see. Let's go. Come on. 
Ooh. No, sorry, the too many bees. I just have to do one lap of it, is that all? I need to do two laps this time, okay. Three wires and two bees. Let's see what you got. Three wires and two bees. One, two, three. One, two. Okay. This is easy. You want to keep playing? All right, should we stop? How long do we keep going for? Am I just keep going indefinitely? Uh, have we had a like little chat, right? Now don't get this hard. I've been working on this. Is that finished? Oh, hang on, I can't see where he is. B, X, Y, X, oh my god. This is, okay. I mean, he's so slow at doing it and shit at doing it. I think I can just take my time anyway, right? Just read what it says. Oh no, he did beat me by going that slow. But he hit his hand, I didn't. Okay. Ugh, it's just it gets so hard to remember. X, where? You're up. Hey, I couldn't even see what he was. Oh, that's not fair. Okay, I did beat him. Why B X B Y? 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 Just giving you a chance. The buying is 80, 80 cents. Was that what it was before? No, 180 cents, right? Nice and easy. Y X B Y B. 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 I knew I had you. B Y X B X B Y X B X B Y X B X B Y X B X B Y X B X B Y X B X B Y X B X B Y X B X Yeah, you savor it while it lasts. Had to think a little bit there. Had a bit of a brain fart. The buy is eighty cents. It's the same. Where's it always? I think we're done here. I think. That was real fun. Later. I think I'll just be playing forever, right? Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Thank you. Don't worry about it, Reverend. I made a fool of myself again. We've all done that, Reverend. I'm bitterly ashamed. Really, I am. Okay, well, let's talk more later. I guess. How dare she? Oh, Abigail and what's her name? I've forgotten her name. The the old bat who's in charge of all the women. I check in. Everything all right? Who does that woman think she is? Sometimes you just gotta humor her. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Real shame about them calendar boys, I reckon. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I once saw Mac beat up 15 sailors. <laughs> that ain't nothing. Everybody knows them Navy boys can't fight. That's why they float. <laughs> That's so. <laughs> sure. That ain't nothing. I once beat up 20. Enough with that damn okay. badge. My lord, but no. you're old. Oh, I'm gonna miss shut my... your trap. I'm not wearing a badge. A man. I've had enough. What kind of fellow you like to rob alongside? Mm, yeah. You know? Mm. Mm. Heartless son of a bitch. But he had a heart. Mm. That makes any sense. <laughs> I know what you mean. I don't need you fussing about. Yeah. Mm. 
the fuck is wrong with you? And time has done you few favors. Look, that's it. I've had well, enough of your behavior. I've had enough of yours. Kind of depressing, if I'm honest. When are you going to learn to shut up? Well, why don't you shut up? You're one tough old boot, ain't you? I know to ignore you when you get like that. Well, you don't, do you? Never better. Damn. I'm still a bit confused about the law outfit. I'm not wearing a badge. Anyway. Oh, I'm not going to antagonize you, though, because I like you. Okay. You want to go hunting? What you prepare for? The greatest of gifts. An unguarded stagecoach. <laughs> no, you simple-minded fool. Bison. Bison? Bison. From which you can get anything. There's some over on the plains, I believe. I saw a couple a long way off. Oh. Right? Good luck. You want to come with me? I'll show you how we hunt one. Sure. Why not? How the hell do you kill a bison? Oh. I guess not with a bow and arrow. I do have an elephant gun. That should do it, shouldn't it? You know, it was before my time, of course, but my mother used to tell me stories of how her tribe moved with the bison. They lived almost as one. Where the bison went, my people went. And they were the center of all life. We couldn't survive without them. They provided us with everything. Food, clothing, shelter, tools. There was a lot of respect. Huh. I don't remember much of my childhood, but I think my people, well, we pretty much moved with the whiskey. <laughs> well, my father did that too. Let's try over here, to the left. To the left, to the left. Over there. Oh, sorry. You see them all? Oh. Incredible, aren't they? We should only kill one of them. I'll keep them ringed in and you see if you can bring one down. Okay? Clean as you can. Okay. What do I use? I have a Springfield. That should be okay, shouldn't it? Do I just kill one or are you going to get a specific one? That one? Do you want me to shoot him? Where do I shoot? Well done. Okay. All right. Skin and butcher it. Take the horns too. It can all be used. Man, that should feed us for a long time. Good job. Throw that on your horse and mount up. I want to go check something out. Okay, let's go. How good was the the pelt? Hey, boy. Where are we going? I thought I saw some scavenger birds over here. Just wanted to see what attracted them. Scavenger birds. Okay, sure. Dead body, possibly. Ooh. No. Look. Bison. Shot and left for dead, it looks like. Why would someone do that? I don't know. But I see tracks heading in this direction. I say we follow them. Alright. Lead the way. I've never done this before. Guess we're gonna go get some revenge on guys who have shot them for sport. Which is what I would assume Charles would be against. So he's like, he's okay for doing it if he used all the animal, right? Could it have been an animal? No, they've been shot. I just don't know why anybody would just leave them here to rot like that. Look, another dead bison. On the hill to the right. Come on. Oh, yep, just spawned in. <laughs> Shot and left for dead again. But this one looks fresher. There's a camp there. I'm gonna take a look. Fire still fresh. Still embers glowing. Some goodies here. Okay. I thought I was gonna inspect something. I was gonna say this fire is still hot. No? Bugs haven't gone cold yet. Right. Maybe half a day since they left. Bison's been dead about the same amount of time. So what do you wanna do? They could still be in the area. Let's get up higher. See if we spot anything. Half a day? Really? Wow. Fire's still glowing half a day. Okay. You see anything? I see some smoke to the east. Maybe another camp? For the look. All right. Let's go. I've got to have a wee before I left. I'm going to wee myself, Charles. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Should have had a wee at the camp. Didn't realize. Bastards. 
killing for fun. You think we can talk? I don't kill for fun. I kill when I need to. Same, Charles. Uh, unless it's O'Driscoll's, then I kill for fun. Look, more dead bison. It has to be them. Come on, wait up. Half a day away. They didn't go far, did they? Get prepared. I think Charles is going to go in angry. I have taken a rifle with me as well, have I? Did you fool shoot those bison? What's your problem? I said, did you fools shoot those bison? Calm down, you black or red bastard, whatever the fuck you are. Um. Did you shoot them? Yes, we did. We shot them bison. We'll shoot you too if you don't get. What business is it of yours? What? We. <laughs> it's that business of mine! Good God, you're crazy! I got a family. A family. Don't shoot me. Stand back, Charles. I'll get you some answers. Those bison had family too. What the hell are you doing? I'm getting answers. Why are you killing those bison and leaving them to rot? I don't know what you're talking about. God damn it, tell us and you're dead. Oh, okay. We were paid to kill as many as we could. What? To make it look like it was Indians. Ah. Uh... No. Please. Don't kill me. I'm begging you. All right. I'll get out of here. Oh, just don't, don't shoot me, mister. I got a family. Then run away. Why did you do that? He didn't need to die. Maybe he'll go tell his friends now what happens to poachers. I've seen enough of this. I'm heading back. Okay. I'm going to see if there's anything worth taking from their camp. I'll catch up with you later. You're not thinking clearly, Charles. You're very angry. Never seen him so angry before. He really wanted me to kill that guy. Poison for a knife pamphlet. Really nice. Make that. Okay, I need to wee. Um, as good a place as any. Okay, mission wise, let's head to John, I think. It's in Valentine. John told you he was trying to get something going in Valentine. The sheep and the goats. <laughs> Be not unkind. Help the blind. Well, I am keep helping you. Give and ye shall receive. But you haven't made any use out of it, have you? You're still here. Help a blind man. Okay, sure. Well? You are not who you think you are, sir. No. Which is lucky. Um, hmm. Okay. I ain't too sure what to make of that. Hmm. I have nothing more for you now. Go use what you know. Don't end up like me. Maybe offer... Self-doubts himself a lot, right? Thinks he's a bad man. Maybe he's yep. saying that he's not because I'm high honourable. What the hell's going on here? This train has stopped. Move it. Move it. Train robbery. On your knees, Cancer. Who is this? We will not take up a moment longer than we got to. I think he's Driscoll's on there. Give over your money and your value. Okay. Case, Mister. Go, go, go. Oh. Is that it? Is anyone else? Hello? Quite a lot of people have died here. I've never seen this before. Someone else doing the train robbery. Is it? These are our driscolls, yeah. Oh, maybe I can um, rob it for myself. <laughs> if there's any valuables on it. The people have gone, I guess. Uh, hello? Okay, he is dead. Okay, yep, yeah, people on here are dead. Did they already loot everything? Looks like it, doesn't it? Check the other carriages.
Uh, who are these guys? Okay. Thought it was the law. This place has already been picked clean. So where is the loot then? They didn't ride off, did they? Search wardrobe? There's nothing in here. There's nothing here. Can I set the train on its way? Easy, whoa. And enter the train. I can drive a train. Where am I going? <laughs> I could try to drive it into Vertide, sure. Didn't know you could do this. Accelerate. I'm not gonna be told off for doing this somewhere. Where do I stop? I overshot it. Is that okay? I think that might be okay. You know. Oh no! Stop! Stop, 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 stop. Okay. You can um, find a, a driver to um, continue this further. Don't enter this and sit and wait for it to leave because it's not going to. <laughs> There's also some dead bodies on there, so you might need to get some cleaners on to clear it out. Okay. Someone gonna help a fella out. Mickey? Somebody, please. Hello, mister. Hey, brother. Remember me? Hey, mister, mister Arthur. Why are you always so mad? You're crazy. All that shooting. And they said I was crazy. I'm not crazy. Not like you. You beat up the big fella. <laughs> he once beat me up. I asked for it. You think you're real crazy, mister? Uh, no. Are you really calling me crazy? I fought in a war, mister. I did. Sent me strange seeing all them fellas die. Which war was that exactly? A bad one, Mr. Arthur. Oh, a real bad. There's good wars? Good point. I... I saw terrible things. I ain't been the same since. Uh, I get, I get funny. I'll go now. Don't act crazy now. Same to you. Definitely have not been the same way because I assume you had an arm before. Right. John is in with the sheep, I think. Where was I? You done enough harm here. You got a problem? Have you? Do you want one? Is that you, how you sell your sheep? <laughs> you antagonize your customers? Good boy. Howdy. So, feeling better? How's the scar? I heal pretty fast. Lucky you. So you just lazing about or you got any leads? I got something. You see them? Sure. Well, you see yourself as a shepherd now? <laughs> Maybe. Come on. Well, where exactly are we going? Collect something. Help us get some sheep. Uh, you know, that attempt to seem all enigmatic and interesting, that might work for Dutch, but for you, it just makes you look stupid. <laughs> Come along. You'll see. That train job was a star, but we need more money. Until we can get back to Blackwater and collect. I'm here to tell you. We try to collect that money anytime soon, it'll come with a noose. I was worried you'd say that. Dutch says that we- Dutch says a lot. That's his gift. Saying things. Oh, yeah? What do you mean by that? I was a prize pony once. Now I'm the workhorse. Listen, Dutch is... But... But, well... You was at that thing in Blackwater. We already seen Pinkerton's here. New century's coming. This life, this way, well, we're the last, I reckon. 
and we ain't long for it. Then that's the way it goes, I guess. For me, yes. All right. Excuse me. So where are we going? Hey, Just need to flying? pick up something. Are you? Second thoughts, huh? <laughs> There's a hitching post over there. Tether the horse, and I'll meet you across the street. Right, I already don't like how this is going. We've lost a lot of weight as well since uh, stopped stuffing my face. It's made a big difference. There is a little bit of clipping going on with the poncho at the back of the bag, but I don't want to get rid of the bag. I don't want to get rid of the poncho, so you just have to deal with it. I think it works better than not with the outfit, having the bag. Like, why would I want to get rid of the bag? I don't. It's the same, it's the same thing with the gloves, right? It's just a little tiny bit of clipping. It's fine. Gun store? Yep. Can you, uh, head in, pick up a sniper rifle? Sniper rifle? I'll explain later. Don't you wear yourself out now. Hello. How can I help you today? Looking for a rifle? Something with a sight on it. Eh, yeah, shouldn't be a problem. If you want to see what we've got, it's all in the catalog here. Okay. Might be able to do a bit of customizing here now, actually, with whatever I'm grabbing. Rifle? I assume it's something that was locked before. Yeah. Sniper rifle. Now, what can we do with this? We can upgrade it first, make it better. Increase range. Uh, the scope? I have a short scope on the other rifle, so medium one or the long one? Would the long one be too long? I mean, it is a sniper rifle. What else would you put a long scope on? So yeah, YM stuff. Long arm varnishes. With like a black or white, I guess. Black's quite nice. I got black, actually. It's quite nice. And then uh, try and get things that suit it. It's quite sleek like that, isn't it? Just all iron. With the black, I think that's nice. Um, do I get any engravings? Never sure about engravings, you know. The frame is the thing that I think I like it with. Yeah, like that. That's fine. That's quite nice. Oh, and this is actually carving is quite nice with this. It's nice. Uh, and ammo. So the standards, you can either increase the damage or the range, right? Would I want to increase range of a sniper rifle? Probably not. I think I'll go with Express for the sniper rifle. That's pretty nice. I like that. If we want to customize some more guns, we can in future, but not on the mission. That snake what we fed must have been poison. Doctor had to take the whole arm. You good? Sure. Huh. Let's go. Why couldn't you have done that? Done what? Bought that gun. I had a run in with that fella earlier. We ain't on the best of terms. You had a run in. I've had a run in with half that town. Calm down. It's done now, ain't it? Why are you being so cagey about all this? Always playing some goddamn game. Me? I ain't the one taking Jack on fishing trips. No, you ain't. <laughs> if you say the boy ain't yours, what's the difference? You probably only run off again. Why are you so interested in my life? Ain't you got one of your own? Just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once, that's all I'm saying. It ain't that simple. You know that as well as anyone. Same as with you and that girl, what was her name, Mary? That was different. No, it ain't. Just the same. Anyway, for the love of God, will you tell me what you got me doing here before I turn around and hit the breeze? There's a herd of sheep coming down to auction from Emerald Ranch. Folk in town were saying the owner's trying to stamp out every farm from here to Ansburg. Yeah, I know that place. Uh, Coal Town, Ansburg, right, I think. Let's head up to the ridge up there. Get a proper view. Okay, lead the way, John. So I'm thinking that the herd will make it to auction all right, but a couple of new ranch hands will be collected on the sale. Doubt the town will care to notice too much. Why we need this rifle you couldn't buy yourself. Reckon we shouldn't get too close. At least not till we know what we're dealing with. Let's see what we can see from up here. That's um, the factory could have stole a stagecoach from if we didn't steal it from Valentine. This game looks fucking amazing, doesn't it? The graphics on it is so good. Okay, I think that's them over there. So what now? Put a shot in near them. I reckon they'll hightail it. 
They're only ranch hands. Just watch the sheep. One has gone. Two has gone. Looks like one of them don't scare too easy. Put another shot in close. He'll get the message. Yep, that spooked him all right. Don't get. All right, let's go round him up. Okay, fun. I remember getting really frustrated with this mission before. <laughs> That's not nice all you got there, John. Come on, let's get down there. You ever work on a ranch, Marston? No. You? Oh, day here, there, but not much. Most cowboys I know were dumb as trees. How hard could it be? I guess we'll soon find out. Let's get these things. Bring them back to the yards. They're pretty scattered. Let's get them all rounded up. Okay, I got this one. Now, in Red Dead 1, no one helped me at all. John did it all by himself. But I think he actually does help in this, I think. Look, he's, he's doing some work there, right? All right, I think we got them all. Let's head for town. You know what? Marston, why don't you leave the sheep to me? You ride Shank, keep watch for any trouble. I brought you in on this. It'll be quicker this way, trust me. Will it? This ain't the right time for you to be learning how to hurt. All right, whatever you say. I'm done arguing. So much for the help. Yeah. I'm going the right way at the moment. Oh, that's more like it. Quickest route back to Valentine is right around that mountain. Okay, like I said, I'll handle this. This is going fine. Have I gone the wrong way? Have I gone the wrong way? Was I meant to go this way around? No, maybe this is okay. I don't remember going this way before. <laughs> I don't remember going up. <laughs> no, this is okay. That is Valentine over there, right? This is fine. I think I have gone a different way, but this is fine. I actually think it's probably quicker than going the other way around. Now you got it! This has gone really smoothly compared to how I remember. Maybe it's all the practice I did in Red Dead 1. You do herding quite a lot in that, don't you? It's a lot easier when there's no lightning or external factors making them all shit scared and jump off cliffs. Good sheep. That's it, straight ahead. Through the finish line, into the auction yard. Nice. Close her up, boys. There you go. Fine sheep. They're okay. Well, you seem better around here. I've seen ones with less ambiguity about their provenance. <laughs> A lot less. What are you trying to say? I'm trying to say you give me 25% kickback, and I won't say nothing to nobody. Everything all right here? Excuse me? Sure. I'll excuse you for 25%. Do you want me to put another hole in your head? Folks swing for rustling livestock. 25%. 15. 20. 18. Done. Calm yourself, friend. Just think of it as I'm buying your sins. Uh, you're buying, but we're paying. Go on now. I'm an angry man. Come back after the auction. You'll get your money. Sure. Dutch is waiting for us at the saloon. He is? Oh, is it? I was just gonna brush Billy quick. He's really, really muddy. Eighteen percent. I thought we was doing the robbing here. Still good money. Well, thanks for all the help with this. Can't herd, can't swim. Have <laughs> a rest, will you? We ain't kids no more. No, well, never really was. So you can swim now, then, can you? If you can, you forget later on in life somehow. Not everything, but come on, the end, sunshine. I don't believe I'll in buy you a whiskey. Just, uh, gentlemen, Dutch, me, and Poe. Where have you been? Working, Marston's thing. Good. And we're just waiting to get some pay on a few sheep. Leopold, my good friend. As long as you're here, why don't you and John go make sure there ain't no funny business? Of course, gentlemen. Drink. Sure. 
Nothing like talking to old Strauss to make you want to blow your own brains out. I should have left him where I found him all those years ago. Bookish little Austrian, fresh off the boat, his eyes out on stalks. Well, I guess the Dutch Vanderlyn finishing school has some strange graduates. That it does. To your good health. Thank you. Might be too late for that. Chin chin. Vanderland! Hello? Get out here! Get out what here the now! Hell? Vanderland! You don't know me, but you keep robbing me! My name is Leviticus Cornwall. I am not a man to be messed with by the likes of you! Get out here! Before I have these men killed! God damn it, John. What do you think? Get out here, well, I... you depraved piece of trash! You start spinning the yarn, and when I think the moment's you right, I'll make a move. You think I got where I am by letting Scott like you rob from me? Vandalin, you're done! Now get out here now! Deal with this nonsense. Please, gentlemen, this is a terrible mistake. This is a case of mistaken identity. What is worse than admonishing a man for the sins of another? Who wants to be the Messiah? Not me, nor do I want to be this Vanderland, whomever he may be. Oh, that's gone right as well. Missed him. Oh, no. There you go. Join your friends. I am Archibald Smith. Imagine being able to shoot like that, man. It's scared the shit out of people, right? What gun am I using? Do you think they were ever worried? John and uh, Strauss with, with Arthur there? Let's move. Oh, my God. Please, first person. Go away. Oh, so I love the outfit so Let's much. Go. Come on. There are you going? That's right at them. We don't run, Mr. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's not a good place to hide. Is there someone in here? Who am I shooting at there? Arthur, cover us. I will push away. Arthur. Sorry, sorry. Fucking around, aren't I? Someone. I'm trying. You don't have Get behind the wagon as we push, Arthur. How, you're still on your feet. God damn it. How are you still alive? I didn't tag him. How much dead have I got? I've got quite a bit dead, I actually. Oh, you wanna come at me? Reload, reload, reload. Fuck me. Shut up. You can talk. We all heard you whine about a little lick from a wolf. But you it's changed. Shut up and kill these bastards. I'm doing it. Shut up. I'm right here, you sons of Ah, it's the walk in it. Um, where's the exit around, isn't it? Who said that? I thought I came from the wreck. This is madness! You're on the front line now, Mr. Strauss! Much more accuracy of this, isn't it? Better than a pistol. I don't even know what that pistol that was. What is it? A kettleman. Yeah, no wonder it was rubbish. I was also using regular bullets. I know this! At least you ain't pushing this thing! I think we're good. They're all dead. <laughs> Horses are over there. Grab Strauss and Ooh. let's go. Why is this house being built here on the corner? Please. Yeah, I'm a bit busy at the moment, Strauss. Leave me like this. Let's get Strauss and go. Come on, come on. Come on, Leopold. Come on, Leopold.
just get this out of here. I'm doing it. God, can you calm this horse down? How am I meant to put him on here? John, this is your horse, isn't it? Looks like we're clear. Let's go. Put, you make sure nobody's following us. We'll get back to camp. We're gonna gather the troops and get them to start packing up. Ugh. Sure. We can't stick around after this. Let's go! <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm still fighting. Bam. 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 Yeah. I think they died. I better get out of here. So much for dead eye, that guy's bleeding out. Okay, yeah, let's let's leave. Yep. Like how have I equipped a cattleman when um, I put it in my weapons locker? Shouldn't be equipped in it. Did someone pass me one? That's the elephant gun I think I got equipped in my bag. Yeah, enough get equipped you some strange guns, doesn't it? I don't know where I got these cattlemans for. I guess maybe I picked them up from someone. Maybe. They have like little diamonds like, next to them. I think they're unique. Is that, is that what that means? I don't quite know what that means. Okay, nice. Did we get gold on that mission, did we? Heard all the sheep. Yeah. Get 25 headshots. Okay. 70% accuracy. Nice. And didn't have to take any health items. Okay, cool. Don't really pay much attention to that, but don't really get gold much. 